You don't understand. I can't work with them. Not on something like this. Uh, isn't there anyone else? They're just... I don't trust them enough for a journey this dangerous. I can't be sure they'll have my back. It's a liability. Uh, no, sir. I'm not trying to question you, but... Can't you see where I'm coming from? We can't work together. They make it impossible. Uh, no, of course not. I wouldn't... I mean, I'm sure you have a good reason, but I really can't... Yes, Professor. I understand. I, I guess I'll try to work with them. Yes, understood. Uh, thank you for the opportunity. I'll try not to let you down. <sighs> oh, hey. Uh, what are you doing here? Uh, can't I have one day without seeing your stupid face? No, I was just sitting in the office for no reason, having tea and biscuits by myself. Of course I was talking to him. There's no way I'm doing this trip with you if I can help it. <laughs> Obviously not. If it worked, I wouldn't be talking to you right now. I'd be off somewhere celebrating my good fortune. Unfortunately, seems I'm stuck with you for the foreseeable future. Assuming you don't get both of us killed. It is a distinct possibility. Hmm? Oh, no, nothing. I didn't say anything. You're paranoid. Anyway, I'm going to go enjoy my next 12 hours of freedom away from you. Since I'm going to be stuck with you for God's know how long, I'd rather be spending my time away from you. Who knows? Maybe I'll get lucky and you'll suddenly be too sick to go on this journey. I'll have to assign someone else to go with me. I'd say see you later, but I hope I don't. Oh, I was hoping you wouldn't show up. Seems luck isn't on my side today, huh? Oh, shut up. I'm not a masochist. I wouldn't be doing this if I didn't have to. <sighs> Whatever. Let's just go over what we're supposed to be doing and make sure you're actually competent enough to read a map, at least. <laughs> Please. I doubt you've ever had to do anything like this. There's no way I'm just going to trust you with knowing where we're going or how to manage anything outdoorsy. If your skills in class are any indication, I should probably be afraid for my life. Right. I'll believe in your so-called survival skills when I see them, which I doubt I will. I've seen you on foraging trips. I wouldn't trust you to lead me down a straight path, let alone on a trip like this. <laughs> Whatever. Let's just go over this map and figure out how long this is going to take us. It's a long way to get where we need to be, so we'll probably be out at least a handful of days, both there and back. We should mark out where we should stop for the night so we aren't left vulnerable. If possible, I'd prefer to stay indoors somewhere, but we probably won't have many options. Say what you want about it, but when it comes down to it, I guarantee you'd rather be inside with a bed than outside in the cold, sleeping on the ground. Exactly. So, shut up and listen while I sort this out. <sighs> right. Assuming we go this way, it shouldn't take us that long to cut through at least the first stretch of woods. But that means we'll have to take the rougher route to the next stop. Sure, it'd save us time, but... I'm pretty sure I'll get a failing grade if you get maimed or die. You can handle it. Yeah, sure you can. And I'm fluent in Infernal. No, I'm not. That was sarcasm. <laughs> Mistaking me for a devil. Good one. How clever. Cards are annoying. No, if you were actually funny, this trip might be much more bearable. I still can't believe they think you and I are somehow on the same skill level. I'm clearly superior to you at healing magic. 
Yes, I am. And if I didn't know it was dangerous to go alone, I would have opted to take this quest on my own. Oh, I guess having you along might be even worse. Now I not only have to look after myself, I have to make sure you don't come back as damaged goods either. See, I wish I could believe that you can take care of yourself, but I don't. I really and truly don't believe that for a second. Just... whatever, we're wasting time. If you want to get to the first stop by nightfall, we need to hurry this up. Which means you shut up and let me explain this route. <laughs> right. Tomorrow we'll keep moving south and get through the next leg of the trip. Assuming we make good time, we should be able to stay in this town, here. Huh? No, there's not a swamp. Why? Look, there's n you're wrong, there's not- I mean, there's nothing on the map here. Look. See, nothing. Huh? You've got to be kidding me. Seasonal swamps. How do you even know about that? I mean, it's not clearly labelled here or anything. Obviously, it's not common knowledge. If it was, I would have known. Yeah, of course I paid attention. That's how I know we never covered this. Ugh, you are so... Whatever, then. If you're so smart, how do you suppose we make it to the inn by tomorrow night? Obviously we won't if there's a fucking swamp in the way. So, <clears throat> what do we do about it? <laughs> no, you've got to be joking. No, no, I'm not camping in a cunting swamp. Unlike you, I don't have a death wish. I mean, come on, think about it. How many waterborne diseases will we be exposed to? How many parasites and insects? How many monsters lurk in the swamp? No, absolutely not. It's not happening. No, you're completely out of your mind. I'm not... I'm... Yes, I'm going to argue about this. There's absolutely no way in hell... Uh, fine. Whatever. If something goes wrong, this is entirely your fault, and I'll hold it against you forever. And if I die, I'll haunt your sorry ass in this life and the next. <sighs> Let's just get moving. We can decide what to do about tomorrow when we get to our first stop. You'd better keep up. If this takes any longer than it has to... No, I don't particularly care about your opinion on this. This is my quest, so we're doing it my way. As if you'd know how to lead a quest anyways. Now let's get moving. We're burning daylight, and I don't particularly care to be stumbling through the woods in the dark. Ah, <sighs> You couldn't possibly be any louder, could you? I mean, honestly, it's like you want to advertise to everything around that we're waltzing through the woods. No, that was definitely you. You stepped on a branch back there, right? I heard that loud crack. It wasn't me. Of course it wasn't. I wouldn't have brought it up if it was, so obviously it had to be you. Unless we... Don't shush me. I was... <sighs> there you go again. What is wrong? Uh, please tell me that was your stomach. Of course not. Uh, what? What is that? Is that a giant fucking spider? Absolutely fucking not. No, 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 no. I'm not doing this. <laughs> weren't supposed to be any monsters. No one warned me about monsters, and especially not spiders. Why is it that big? <laughs> Don't tell me to shut up. What? No, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you getting a knife out for? What are you... 
No, whatever you're planning, stop it. Yeah, obviously, we're going to run. That's the plan, so why are you getting closer to it? You can't just run at a giant spider with a knife. Oh, hell no. No, no, you're out of your mind. What are you... fuck is wrong with you? You could have died. Or gotten us both killed. Are you insane? <laughs> what do you mean? It's just a spider. That's not just a spider. It's fucking ten feet tall. You're certifiable. Where'd you even get a knife like that? I had it the whole time, did you? You're crazy. Why do you need a knife like that when we're just looking for a mushroom? Of course I didn't bring a weapon. Do alert the type to wield something like that. I've got a little foraging knife for getting through mushroom stalks, but yours is practically a machete. Excuse me? I'm not unprepared. I just didn't think I'd need to arm myself for something like this. Well, yeah, I did say that. But again, I didn't think we'd be facing any monsters or giant spiders or... Ugh, don't even go there. I know what I said earlier. You don't need to bring it up. I thought this would just be a light quest with a bit of legwork. God, you're the worst. Stop. Whatever. Let's just keep moving. Hopefully we won't run into anything else like that. I already told you I didn't bring one with me. Got my little foraging knife, but I don't... Uh, no, get that thing away from me. I don't want your slimy spider blade. Look at all the stuff all over it. <laughs> You're out of your mind. <laughs> Fine. I'll give you that. You did save our asses this time. But that's all the thanks you're getting. We need to keep moving now. It'll be dark before we can make it to the camp. What are you looking around in there for? Uh, did, did you just throw a knife at me? What is wrong with you? Uh, so what if it's sheathed? Uh, this can't be... I mean, didn't you have to learn like safe knife skills to get something like this? You don't just throw a knife at someone, just like how you don't point a bow at them. You know what? Fuck it, never mind. You won't listen to me anyway. And now I know that you're the most likely culprit if I'm maimed in my sleep. Can you blame me? You almost just got the both of us killed. I'm hardly being overdramatic. I'm being perfectly reasonable. In shock. <laughs> I'm not in shock. I'll give you that impression. Well, just because I happen to go the wrong way doesn't mean I'm in shock. You're projecting. I said I'm not. That's enough. Let's just... Let's just keep going. Hi. We'd... <clears throat> we'd like two rooms, please. There's only one. Of course there is. Does it have two beds? A cot. Okay. I guess that'll have to work. We'll take it. What are you doing? I was going to get... Uh, we're all set? Great, thank you. Um... Uh, one more the cot be set after dinner. Okay. Thanks. <sighs> Suppose we should probably eat something, huh? We barely stopped for lunch. I'm starving. <sighs> yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, could you just... I said I'm fine. So drop it. 
Yeah, I'll have a tankard of ale, please. What about you? Thanks. Could you not look at me like that? Nothing's wrong. I'm being annoying. Just stop it. I know you didn't say anything. You don't have to. It's all over your face. I said I'm fine. Oh, thanks. Uh, could we also get... Um, yeah, what they said, the stew, please. Thank you. <sighs> I know, I keep sighing. You don't have to point it out. Look, I'm just tired, I'm hungry, I'm irritated, and all I want to do is eat and wash and go to bed. Is that enough for you? Or do I need to describe every single... Huh? No, I'm not... I didn't get injured. Why would I be injured? I'm not the one who fought a giant spider. If anyone should be asking, it should be me. Did you get injured? No, good. That would have been a hassle. My arm? What about it? No, it's fine. What are you doing? I said it's fine. Stop, you're making a big deal. I'm <laughs> Fuck. Is this... Is this really necessary? It's just a scrape. I got it when I tripped earlier. <laughs> I didn't tell you because it's not a big deal. It's just a scratch. I was planning on cleaning it and patching it up after we found somewhere for the night. Stop hovering. <laughs> I won't get infected. I'm a healing student, remember? I know what I'm doing. Stop nagging me. Thank you. <sighs> you don't have to worry so much, you know. Well, I thought I'd be the one worrying about you. Guess that was misplaced. <sighs> I don't know. Nothing's wrong. We're both fine. So why... I mean, you saved us both. But why do I... <sighs> It's stupid. Never mind. Let's just drop it. I said drop it. Just eat. <sighs> what are you doing? I said I'm taking the cot tonight. Get off. <sighs> no, that's not what we agreed on. It's, it's just a scratch. I'm hardly injured. It doesn't change anything. You're being stubborn. Get in the bed. Uh, fine. You've really worn me down today. I don't have the energy to argue with you. Just... Whatever. <sighs> hey, I guess... Thanks. For... For saving me earlier. And keeping us on task. I... I appreciate it. And that's all the thanks you're getting from me, so don't let it get to your head. <sighs> We're both alive and fine, so why do I feel so shitty about it? <sighs> I guess... I just felt useless. You completely took over. This was supposed to be my quest. I was supposed to be the one leading. But you... <laughs> you just had to show me up. Like you always do. Uh, don't get me wrong, I'm lucky you were there. I probably would have been dead otherwise. But I mean, it's just... I feel like I can't really do anything, you know? I know the basics of adventuring and whatever, and I know how to navigate, or I thought I did. Since it's the off-season, I didn't think there'd be any monsters or things to deal with, so I wasn't... I didn't anticipate having to fight anything. So I was basically useless. And afterwards... Afterwards, I just couldn't stop thinking about how, if you weren't there, 
I'd be spider food. It's, that's not fair. <laughs> Don't try to comfort me. I'm just being dramatic. I call it ego, but I feel like I'm supposed to be better than you. But I couldn't even handle today. It doesn't matter. It's over. And tomorrow's another day. <laughs> yeah. I won't let you better me tomorrow. So watch out. Good night.